Yo, yo, what is good? Welcome back to another video. Here go a little update. Uh, I said I was going to do a new video today about my radiator cap. I think these caps are pretty good because uh, there was this lever right here is what relieves the pressure. So if it is hot, you pull this, it'll relieve the pressure in the system so you can pull this out safely. But I put a new one in. I had to put it down. It was kind of a hassle, but here goes what was wrong with my other one. It was corroded. See how corroded and bad, and that's coming off, and this is like all. Okay, so what would happen? Here go a little trick to y'all. So y'all can test it yourself if y'all have any pressure problems, which this is the trick that I learned. Okay, so see this reserve right here? See how it's right there? I'll fill it up to like right there. And I'll just drive it and you'll notice my gauge, like your uh, pressure gauge, like your hot, like you'll notice jump up and then all of a sudden jump down and do it multiple times. Just pay attention to it. But it was an easy fix. I just bought a cap. And this is just, this never been replaced. See how corroded that's missing. But just remember y'all, when y'all go to replace the radiator, remember about the cap. I didn't think you replaced the radiator cap. You replaced the radiator, the top holes, the bottom holes, and then the thermostat housing is in here. And your thermostat is in here. And then the functions to that, here goes your, your gauge, your hot, cold gauge. This is what controls it, and this is what, uh, I forget the, the sensor it's called. And then this is the coolant, uh, the coolant, coolant temperature sensor right here. This one right here. So, this... I gotta get some degreaser or engine degreaser. Just go take my time and give this bad boy a little clean. This stiff engine. Y'all like, subscribe to my channel. I appreciate the support. I'm getting off here. 